everyone, and welcome back to CCN Gaming and the Season 2 Finale here at SummerSlam in Tampa, Florida, where two rosters meet, a SmackDown and Raw Waster, and we have a ton of championship matches. How exciting is this going to be? Welcome here at SummerSlam for our opening match of the night here. What a way to get things started with tag team action. And here comes Apollo Crews. Apollo Crews, one of the challengers for the SmackDown Live Tag Team Championships. This story goes back a couple of weeks where Brock Lesnar was attacked by the Ascension. Apollo Crews would step in to help. On the same night, Baron Corbin would take on Dean Ambrose and drop Dean Ambrose in the ring and then continue the assault after the match was over. So Dean Ambrose had joined forces with Apollo Crews beating the Ascension on the last episode of SmackDown Live. And now they get their opportunities at the SmackDown Live Tag Team Championships here tonight as Apollo Crews making his way into the ring here at SummerSlam. And here comes his partner, the Lunatic Fringe and Dean Ambrose. This is the last pay-per-view of Season 2, by the way. The season 2 wraps up Season 3 will begin on WWE 2K18. And what a way to kick off this last pay-per-view. Part 1 of the SummerSlam pay-per-view as Dean Ambrose and Apollo Crews are set to take on these two. Nothing like making the challengers wait. And here come the SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions. The Ascension. Making their way down to the ring here. What a match this is going to be to open up SummerSlam here. we got to know that Dean Ambrose and Apollo Crews are going to be on their A game here. As they hit the ring here. The Ascension, a powerhouse in the tag team division. Also part of the Wolf Pack, along with Kalisto and Baron Corbin. Speaking of Baron Corbin, in the main event, part four of the SummerSlam pay per view, Baron Corbin takes on Brock Lesnar for the WWE Championship in a no DQ match. Without further ado, let's get into this tag match here. What a matchup this is gonna be. Tag Team Championships on the line. Apollo Crews and Dean Ambrose look ready. The challengers look ready to win those championship titles. And the champions, the Ascension, always ready to fight. And they look ready to defend those SmackDown Live Tag Team Championships. As Connor and Victor are set to take on Apollo Crews and Dean Ambrose. Right now as the ref secures the championship titles. And holds them high in the ring. What a match this is going to be. As the bell rings and this one is off. Here we go, this one is off. Apollo Crews already on the offensive. Reversal here from Connor. Landing right flat on Apollo Crews here. And Connor now 
Looking to attack. Apollo Cruz here backing him into the corner. Tag into Victor now. The legal man for the ascension. Apollo Cruz starting off. Bros. And himself. And look at that huge move into the corner. Goes Apollo Cruz to kick off the SummerSlam pay per view. Irish whipped right there. And look at that. Connor and Victor working together seamlessly. That is why they're the SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions. And right there, Apollo sweeping the leg of Connor. And now Victor back in the ring. Drop kick to Apollo out of nowhere. Catching him. Apollo had his attention turned towards Connor. And now look, Diddy T there from Apollo Cruz. Dropping him right flat on his head. And now Dean Ambrose, the legal man. And a shot there to Dean Ambrose. Looked like Victor was going to take out Apollo Cruz. A drop down here. Huge running knee from Victor. Takes down Dean Ambrose. And now Victor looking to add insult to injury. Huge shot there to Dean Ambrose. Victor now taking Dean back into the corner here. Looking for another tag into Connor. Misses it. Reversal here from Victor once again. Shot to the back here of Dean Ambrose. And now Victor sending Ambrose back into the corner here. This time getting the tag onto Connor. And looking for another double team maneuver. Huge clothesline from Connor. Takes down Dean Ambrose. As now Connor has Ambrose. Connor looking to capitalize. Takes Ambrose up. Huge move here. Look at the strength of Connor. You gotta wonder if this is trying to get into the head of Apollo Cruz. We saw Apollo Cruz do this to Victor and Connor on SmackDown Live the last episode. As Connor here now. As Dean Ambrose, Irish whip to the ropes here. Looking for the big boot. Reversal here from Connor. What a quick turnaround. Connor now looking for something. Ambrose with a knee to the back. Taking him down. Connor now with a boot to the face here on Ambrose. And Connor plows him over. Fast tag team action as the Ascension now just keeping Dean Ambrose cornered here. Right where they want him. Smart tag team work here by the Ascension. And look at this. More tag team action here. And look at this. Setting up the plow over Dean Ambrose. And they do. What a shot there from the Ascension. Taking down Dean Ambrose. And now Victor taking him into the corner. Victor has Ambrose taking him out of the corner. Now Victor from the second rope. Victor looking to fly here, dropping the fist right onto the forehead of Dean Ambrose. And now Victor calling Ambrose up to his feet. Victor looking for something, a huge clothesline to the back of the head there from, on Ambrose. And now Victor looking to capitalize again. He's got Dean Ambrose up. He floats through, kick to the back of the knee here of Victor of the Ascension. Fireman's carry here now from Victor. And Victor with a huge running knee. Takes down Dean Ambrose once again. Now Victor looking to end this already. Victor sweeping the leg onto Ambrose. And we could see retaining the titles this quick right here on SummerSlam. Taking down Ambrose here. What a shocker that would be. Into the corner goes Dean Ambrose. Tag in to Connor. Here we go. Looking for the fall of man here from the SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions. And they just took him out. Getting on the pin here. The ref counting, but Apollo Crews breaking it up here. And Apollo getting tossed out to the floor. And Victor having none of that. As now Victor heading out to the floor to deal with Apollo Crews. Victor's got him. Connor in the ring dealing with Dean Ambrose. And Dean Ambrose is hurt, guys. Dean Ambrose is hurt. And look at this. Ambrose, German suplex, takes over Connor. Reversal here from Connor. Knee to the face here on Dean Ambrose. And look at that Victor interrupting the mat. And now the Ascension taunting here. As now Connor calling Dean Ambrose up to his feet. Connor looking for something here. Connor. Huge belly to belly takes Dean Ambrose over right there. And now Connor taunting once again. Connor this time takes Apollo off the apron. I don't think Apollo even saw that coming. And the Ascension going to add insult to injury here. Well, I said that. 
But just as I say that, Dean Ambrose, reverse DDT, takes down Connor. Reversal here from Connor now. And this isn't good for Ambrose. Flapjack there from Connor. And Apollo Crews looking to go off the apron again, but catches a huge kick to the head, does Connor. And now Connor looking to strike Apollo off the apron, catches a right hand from Apollo once again. And this time, Connor achieves his goal here. And now Dean Ambrose has Connor on the ropes. Reversal here from Connor. Taking Dean Ambrose into the corner now. Out over the top goes Dean Ambrose. Connor now taunting. Apollo Cruz is outside the ring. Connor looking to end Apollo Cruz right here. Slams him to the mat on the outside. What an assault here. As now Connor looking to take Dean Ambrose back into the ring here. Dean Ambrose just bouncing off the ring post now. Referee at a count of three now. Taking him back into the ring now is Connor. Connor takes Apollo off the apron. Or I'd like to say the fourth time in this match. And now wait, Connor looking for something. Dean Ambrose off the reversal. Dean looking for something reversal here from Connor. Connor taking Dean into the corner. Connor setting up here. Fall of Man again. Fall of Man is coming again. Apollo in the mix this time. And it means nothing. Apollo getting taken off the apron once again. Pin in on Ambrose. Could this be it for the Tag Team Championships? Two and three. Connor and Victor successfully retain here at Smack here at SummerSlam. They retain the SmackDown Live Tag Team Championships. What tag team action to kick off SummerSlam right there. Look at that huge tag team maneuver. That one as well, the clothesline off the second rope from Connor. Two fall of mans, and Ambrose just couldn't take any more punishment. As the second fall of man would come in right here, and then what? Victor would take Apollo Crews off the apron, going for the pin for the three count, and they would retain their tag team championships here tonight. The Ascension going into season three as a SmackDown Live tag team champions victorious here at SummerSlam what a matchup to open up SummerSlam we still got one more matchup to come here on part one of the SummerSlam pay-per-view let's get to that Well, as I said, still more action to come as Asuka takes on the SmackDown Live Women's Championship here on part one of the SummerSlam pay-per-view and the season two finale of WWE 2K17 Universe Mode. Let's get to the match. Welcome back inside the SummerSlam Arena here in Tampa, Florida as we get ready for the main event here on part one of the SummerSlam pay-per-view. Following is for the SmackDown Live Women's Championship and it is scheduled for one fall. Ah, oh, man. Here comes the Empress of tomorrow and it could be the next Smackdown Live Women's Champion as Asuka makes her way down to the ring to take on the self-proclaimed Queen of the Women's Division Charlotte Flair Asuka is here at SummerSlam what a match this is gonna be what a part one is going to be to kick off the SummerSlam pay-per-view as Asuka makes her way into the ring, making her signature entrance. 
I've said it before, I'll say it again. Season 3 will continue on WWE 2K18 after a about a month hiatus to give a little break to learn the game and to jump right back into universe mode. There's a few bugs that need to be worked out too, so once I feel comfortable in starting a new universe mode, we will do so and we'll continue with Season 3 of Universe Mode on WWE 2K18. Then I'll continue right where this one left off as well. Charlotte Flair now about to make her entrance. And here comes the self-proclaimed queen of the women's division and the SmackDown Live women's champion. She is the dirtiest woman in the game, Charlotte Flair. What a competitor Charlotte is, gaining that championship. Former Raw superstar coming over to SmackDown, claimed the title here and has held it since. Now could have a real chance at losing it here tonight against a competitor like Asuka. Asuka prevailing at Battleground. Not, I mean, Asuka not prevailing at Battleground as Charlotte was able to beat Asuka and retain her championship. Asuka gets one more opportunity here tonight at SummerSlam to do the unthinkable and walk away with the championship. And that is the prize here in this matchup. That's SmackDown Live Women's Championship. What a match this is going to be as the ref Holds it up high. The challenger, Asuka. The champion, Charlotte Flair. As the bell rings and this one is underway. Asuka right out of the gate with a heel kick to Charlotte Flair. Asuka looking to get into the skin of Charlotte early here. As Asuka now setting up for a back suplex, dropping Charlotte on her head. And Asuka now taunts to the fans. Asuka knows she came up on the losing end and catches a bulldog off the taunt. As I was saying, Asuka knows she came out on the losing end at Battleground and she has something to prove here tonight. Charlotte in a head scissors here on Asuka trying to make her tap. Didn't work as Asuka now goes for the clothesline. Charlotte ducks and Asuka catches nothing but ring posts there. And Asuka now is down, but Asuka with a punch to the gut there on Charlotte. And now Asuka, huge float around, German suplex there on Charlotte. What a move there from Asuka. Irish whip here now to the SmackDown Live Women's Champion. The drop down, the leapfrog. And now Asuka with a huge knee to the gut. Asuka getting this crowd behind her here. And Charlotte not having any of this. Huge German suplex from Charlotte off the second rope. And... Asuka lands on the back of her head here and Charlotte now with an elbow to the head of Asuka and Charlotte now getting caught in a reversal heel kick there from Asuka Asuka's all over Charlotte here tonight so far Asuka with an Irish whip into the corner sends Sasha in a huge hip attack there from Asuka as Asuka drops Charlotte down now Asuka now has Charlotte taking her out to the apron here Asuka Got the champion bringing her back in. Insult to injury. And Asuka taunts here once again. Asuka waiting for the champion to get back to her feet here. Not sure if that's smart tactics or not. She should be staying right on the champion. As aggressive as the champion is. And Asuka now looking to take Charlotte out. Charlotte off the reversal though. And now Charlotte getting caught once again. Wait, Charlotte, no, catching Asuka here. Charlotte, huge strength there from Charlotte to take Asuka down. Now ran into a pin. It doesn't even get a one count as Asuka kicks out immediately. Asuka now, wait, reversal here from Asuka. Huge Hurricane Rana takes over Charlotte right there. And now Asuka calling Charlotte up to her feet here. Asuka calling Charlotte up to her feet. Asuka looking for the signature move already. Asuka with the hip attack takes down Charlotte in on the pin. One, two, three, known. Charlotte gets the shoulder up. I thought we were going to see a new champion right there. As Asuka now takes Charlotte out to the apron. Asuka spears Charlotte off the apron right there. 
And wait, the Empress now. The Empress is perched up top, calling Charlotte up to her feet on the outside. Asuka dives, looking for a drop kick and misses it. Asuka now has Charlotte. Into the ring goes Charlotte now, off of the huge mishap there from mishap there from Asuka. Asuka now back up top, drop kick to Charlotte, misses again. Charlotte shrugs it off. Charlotte now has Asuka, center of the ring almost. Look at the strength here from Charlotte once again, throwing Asuka around. Charlotte now looking for something, misses. Asuka now, it's got her. Backslide here, dropping Charlotte on her head, going in for a pin one. Who knows? Charlotte kicks out. What a maneuver that was. Huge move there from Asuka. And now Asuka looking for another hip attack here. Can she get Charlotte this time? She's got her down again. The champion's down. New champion. Who knows? Charlotte kicks out for the second time in a row. And Asuka looking on in disbelief here. Asuka looking on in disbelief and wait. Asuka thinks it's time for the Asuka lock here. On to Charlotte. She's getting it. Locked in. Asuka's got the Asuka lock. Locked in on Charlotte Flair. Can she make the self-proclaimed queen of the women's division tap here? Asuka's got her dangerously close, but no. Charlotte removing the arm. Elbow to the face there on Asuka. These two know each other so well. And know just exactly what everybody's moves are. Charlotte now has Asuka in the ring. Charlotte, huge neck breaker there to Asuka. And Asuka rolls out of harm's way. Asuka now has a hold of Charlotte. Huge Irish whip sends the women's champion into the barricade. Charlotte off the reversal here once again. Reversal here from Asuka. Asuka taking the... Champion back into the barricade again, and Asuka with an Irish whip takes Charlotte back first into that barricade. What a matchup this is. Asuka now takes her back into the ring. Charlotte down. Asuka picking her up now. Asuka has Charlotte on the outside. Wait. No, we've seen this so many times. Asuka setting up for the DDT onto the apron. To the SmackDown Live Women's Champion. Asuka with a huge DDT right there. Taking Charlotte down. And that could be it for Charlotte here as Asuka rolls her into the ring. Asuka now following her in. Is that going to be enough as Asuka goes in for the pin here on Charlotte 1? The 2. The three, no! Charlotte kicks out just before the three, and Asuka can't believe it. I thought Asuka had her there, and I think Asuka did too. Asuka now, wait. Asuka going up top here. Asuka looking to fly. Huge move on to Charlotte. And Asuka there might have caught the women's champion. Asuka calling Charlotte up to her feet. I think I know what she's going for here. If she hits it again, it could be all over. The hip attack there from Asuka. In on the pin. New champion. Two, three, no. Charlotte kicks out once again. My God, what does Asuka have to do as she's sizing up? Charlotte one more time. Kick to the chest. Another one. Asuka on fire, roundhouse kick to the face. And this has got to do it. A pin here on Charlotte once again. The ref trying to get into position. Two, three, no! Charlotte, for all intents and purposes, should have been pinned right there. Somehow, I think just on instinct alone, Charlotte kicks out. Iris whip to the ropes here now from Asuka. Asuka with a drop down on Anita the gut once again. Asuka trying to do anything possible to keep Charlotte down here. Asuka with a right hand shot. Asuka looking for another one. Charlotte with a shot to the face. Charlotte with a neck breaker takes down Asuka right there. Charlotte now taunting. Calling Asuka. 
Helena to bring it on here, the champion. Arrogant as ever. Hauls Asuka into the center of the ring here. Charlotte with a knee to the face there to Asuka. Now Charlotte looking for something. Kick to the face from Asuka now. Asuka now looking for something. Charlotte rolls her up. Got her caught here. Not even a one count. Asuka kicks out immediately. Now Asuka looking to catch Charlotte here. Dropping her on her head. Charlotte pulls her up here. Irish whip right here from Charlotte. I mean from Asuka. Charlotte wait. Charlotte wait getting caught in her own roll up here. And she kicks out. Got a rope break actually. Shot to the face here from Asuka. Asuka looking to capitalize. Charlotte with a snapmare taking her down. Huge knee to the back there of Asuka. And now Asuka is down. And Charlotte looking to capitalize here. Spear onto Asuka. Spear onto Asuka from Charlotte. This could do it right here. Charlotte going in for the pin. No, Asuka kicks out before the one. Charlotte can't believe at the heart of Asuka to kick out before the one count even. Charlotte with a knee to the kidneys there of Asuka. Charlotte looking for something. Wait, reversal here from Asuka. Kick to the face. Kick to the face from Asuka. Asuka calling Charlotte up to her feet here. If she hits this, it's all over. Asuka looking for another roundhouse kick. She gets it. In on the pin. Asuka can get Charlotte right here. One, two, three. And Asuka's done the unthinkable. The Empress of Tomorrow has just beaten Charlotte Flair and become the new SmackDown Live Women's Champion. What a matchup. Here to part one of SummerSlam. This is what it's all about. Look at that huge move there from Asuka. I thought she had it right there. I thought Charlotte could have had a broken neck after that move. Asuka here would hit that hip attack. Look at that roundhouse kick there from Asuka. And we have a new champion, folks. Thank you guys for joining us here on part one of the SummerSlam pay-per-view. Tune in tomorrow for more season two finale action here at 9 a.m. as we have part two of the SummerSlam pay-per-view and Asuka has got the championship that she so rightfully deserves. She didn't get it done at Battleground but instead she got it done here at SummerSlam and it means that much more. New Smackdown Live Women's Champion and Asuka.